Welcome, my friends. Thank you so much for joining me here on Yoga TX. I'm Jen Hillman, and I invite you to roll out your mat for today's very special self-love moving meditation. One of my favorite things about the yoga practice is how it invites us to deepen our relationship with ourself. And it is truly in that practice of self-love that we begin to thrive and shine as our best self. So go ahead and like this video, leave your comments below, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And when you're all set, go ahead and roll out your mat. And let's get ready to practice a little self-love. We're gonna begin this gentle practice sitting in a nice easy seat. If you wanna sit on a cushion or a blanket, just have your props handy so that you can really nurture and love yourself today. Let yourself get settled in to that easy seat. And we'll start by turning your attention inward. So you can close your eyes and begin to observe the flow of your breath your closest ally, your lifelong friend. This breath. It is this breath that is your gateway to the present moment, bringing you into the here and now Nourishing your body with life. Providing oxygen to every single cell in your body. So as you tune in, let yourself fall in love with this breath. And tune in and feel your body. Notice how your body responds and just how good it feels to breathe. And if you notice any tension or discomfort in your body, just send your breath to those places. Inviting yourself to soften and relax. And bring your hands onto your knees. We're going to incorporate some movement with that breath. So on your next inhale, lift up your heart, roll your shoulders back, gently lift your chin and arch your spine, and exhale and curl it in, rounding your back. Tuck your chin to your chest and rock back as you stretch your spine, and inhale to come forward, rolling your shoulders back. Let the breath and the movement be equal. Exhale, slowly guiding yourself back, breathing to the completion of your exhale and feeling that transition as you move again into the inhale, opening your heart and chest. See if you can find a continuous flow of movement just like the continuous flow of your breath. Nice and steady. And on your next inhale, let's come back up to center and begin to sway your spine from side to side. You could almost imagine 
that you are like a little piece of seaweed swaying in the current. Let your head flow as part of the movement, gently rocking your spine from side to side. So there's no right way or wrong way to do this movement. It's all about your self-love. So as long as it feels good, you're doing it right. When you're ready, and slowly begin to resolve your movement, gently making your way back to center. And we're going to just take it into some nice, easy head rolls. So lifting up through your spine, begin to slowly circle your head around. Stretching into your neck. Exploring that full range of motion. And when you're ready, you can reverse direction. And see how it feels when you circle your head the other way. Just noticing the changes, observing what you feel. Taking your time as you flow. And slowly make your way back to center, letting your head gently find its way back on top. Take a full deep breath in and exhale a full breath out. And on your next inhale, reach that left arm up and over towards the right side. And as you exhale, just lean a little deeper into that stretch. Then we'll inhale up through center and exhale to the other side, stretching over towards the left. And we're just making that movement back and forth. Inhale, moving through center. And exhale, leaning to the side. Inhale through center and exhale to stretch. You can move at your own pace here, moving according to the flow of your own breath. Maybe it's a little faster or a little slower. It doesn't really matter. It's all about tuning in, trusting the flow of your own breath, in your own body. Slowly inhale back to center. When you're ready, you can exhale. Just letting your hands relax down to your lap. Now from here, we're gonna extend your right leg out in front of you. Bringing your left foot to the inside of your right thigh. And bring your hands down to the floor along either side of that right knee. Pressing your hands into the mat, take an inhale to lift up through your chest. And as you exhale, fold your body down, folding over your right leg, all the way to the end of your exhale. And inhale to lift halfway up, pressing into the earth as you lift your chest and extend through your spine. Then exhale and fold it back down, softening with the pull of gravity, taking it to the depth of your stretch. Then we inhale to lift, extending through your heart and your spine. And exhale and fold it back down. And again, let's inhale and lift halfway up. This time as you exhale, bring that left hand to the outside of your right leg and reach the right hand back. And we'll inhale to lift up your chest and deepen that twist. And exhale to fold down over your right leg, 
maintaining that twist. Take it into your deepest stretch. And on your next inhale, we're going to rise, circling that left arm all the way up and back. Let your left hand touch down to the floor. Then inhale and rise, stretching your hips towards the sky. Reach your right arm up and back. And exhale and softly land your hips back down to the floor. Let's hug your knees in right here, just wrapping your arms around your shins. Give yourself a deep self-love squeeze. And we'll get ready to move through that cycle on the other side. So extend the left leg out, opening your right knee towards the side. And we'll just start by placing your hands to the mat on either side of that left leg. Flowing with the breath, we inhale to lift up your heart, extend out through your spine, then exhale to let it fold down over that left leg. Let your head and neck completely fold in, then inhale and lift, extending up through your spine, really finding that flow. Exhale to fold. So we learn to trust the rhythmic flow of your breath. Inhale to lift. Trusting in the wisdom of your body. Exhale and let it fold. Finding the depth of your stretch. And again, let's inhale and rise. Then exhale, and this time we'll step that right hand to the outside of your left leg and reach the left fingertips back. Inhale to leverage a deeper twist. Then exhale to fold it down. Maintaining that twist as you fold over your left leg. Take a full cycle of breath as you fold your body down. Then we'll inhale and circle your right arm all the way up and back. And inhale to lift up your hips, stretching that left arm up and back. Press your hips forward and stretch. And exhale and slowly wind your hips back down to the floor. Hug your knees in, wrap your arms around your shins and give yourself a squeeze. And here we're gonna slowly come up and over to fold over your legs. So press yourself up lift your hips and start to fold forward here. Now, again, in keeping with that self-love movement, let's begin to shift your weight side to side. You can play with bending one knee and then the other as you gently rock your weight from right to left. It's almost like making a figure eight with your hips. Really just allowing yourself to feel and observe. Notice what's going on in your body. And breathe that slow, deep, satisfying breath. And when you're ready, you can begin to make your way back to center, just folding down here, folding forward over your legs. Now again, let's inhale and lift your spine, extending your heart forward with a nice big inhale. And exhale to slowly fold your body back down. 
inhale to lift. Reach your heart forward as you stretch. Then exhale and slowly fold it back down. Again, inhale and lift, waving your heart forward. Then exhale and fold it right back down. Now we're going to bring in a little change. So let's inhale and lift halfway up. This time as you exhale, bend into the left knee and twist your right fingertips to the sky. Take another inhale here as you twist a little deeper. Then we'll exhale and release, folding back down over your legs. Preparing for the second side, we inhale to lift and extend through your spine. Then as you exhale, bend that right knee and reach the left fingertips up. Inhale here as you work a little deeper into the twist. Then exhale and gently release, folding right back down over your legs, coming all the way down into that deep, juicy forward fold. Then from here, bring your knees all the way down to your mat. We're coming to a kneeling pose, and I'm going to have you ha lift your hips up away from your heels. Now, I recommend curling your toes under here. This is going to bring more stability and strength into your legs. It helps to protect your knees. So from this position, we're going to do a little more moving flow. And I'll kind of walk you through the movement and then you can pick it up with me when it makes sense. So we start by reaching your right hand towards the right heel. Then you inhale and extend the left arm up and back. And as you exhale, you roll your body towards the front and inhale to the other side, bringing the left hand to the left heel and opening the right arm up and back. Exhale to roll your body forward and over to the other side. And we inhale to lift the hips and open your heart. Exhale, going down and around to the second side. Then inhale to lift, opening through your heart. Exhale, coming back to the start. Inhale to lift. Exhale and circle it down and around. Then inhale to the other side. So these heart openers are so beneficial, not only for your posture and for reducing back pain, but also for increasing feelings of love and receptivity. Let's take one more round, closing out this cycle. Inhale to lift your hips and open your beautiful heart. This time as you exhale, we're going to come down and around to a child's pose. So you can untuck your toes, let your forehead rest on the mat. And I like to bring my arms down by the sides, letting your palms flip up towards the sky. Let your shoulders relax down towards the earth and breathe into your back. Breathe into that space behind your heart. Let each and every breath fill you with more radiant love and light. 
and slowly glide your hands underneath your shoulders. Press yourself up to that kneeling pose. Then guide your hips over to the side and you can swing your legs around in front of you. Coming back into a nice easy seat. And we're gonna close our self-love moving meditation with just a little stillness. So as you come back into your seat, you can close your eyes and come back to that space of personal observation. Observing the flow of your breath. Observing the beating of your beautiful heart. And just notice the residual feelings in your body. And I invite you to open your heart to feel gratitude and appreciation for your breath as it moves in and out and sustains you and keeps you alive. Feeling so much love and gratitude for this incredible body of yours, moving you through life on earth. And even if it's hard, let yourself breathe into a deep feeling of love and appreciation for the sweetness of who you are. Thank yourself for showing up on the mat today and for every day that you show up for yourself. And thank you for allowing me to be your guide and to walk with you on this journey of learning to love yourself. Now, I would love to connect with you further, so please reach out and find me on Instagram and Facebook at Jen Hillman. You can also visit my website, jenhillman.com. I want to give a special thanks of gratitude to my friends at Herbivore for sending me this incredible gift of a beautiful eco-friendly yoga mat. Thank you for this beautiful blessing. And I want to give an extra, extra special thank you to my friends here at Yoga TX. Thank you for having me as part of my, as part of this team. Thank you for being a part of this community. If you would love to get more of your favorite Yoga TX videos ad free, check out the links below and visit the new Yoga V community. Sending you so much love, gratitude, and deep appreciation. Until next time, namaste.